Oh, good morning. Got this 7-Eleven. It's a double stack for $7.50, but they go into the same person. So it's funny. If he would have ordered one order, I wouldn't have done his order. But because he ordered two and DoorDash added that extra two bucks or whatever, made it worth it for me. Yo, I just got this Uber. Ba -da -ba -ba -ba. Man, McDonald's is jacked up right now. Everybody's loving it. This motherfucker. <laughs> All right, I took this Uber. Definitely not the best order. High mileage, but ain't nothing happening. They sent me this one like three times and they kept you know, like they've sent me like four orders like three times each so no one must be on uber or something I, I don't know what's going on but they raised the money enough that i decided i'd do it all right today is the opposite of yesterday yesterday was crazy today has been so slow but i've been editing a video already so that's good uh, this order was good for me going right next to my house 13 bucks so I'm sitting here editing videos <clears throat> and I just saw the DoorDash map was red and I signed in and they sent me this Petco order y'all are asking way too much it's probably 200 pounds of dog food 19 miles like most of the order looks pretty good because they're all close to each other but that's garbage all right i got a mama room was at lunch time i'm gonna drop this off get myself some lunch go for a bike ride all right it's funny doordash said they extended my arrival time like my house is like on the borderline so like a lot of times i'll be you know in the zone at my house but then sometimes they'll be like you're not in the zone at my house it all it don't matter anyway i got this instacart it's only a nine bucker but it looks like it's some diapers and some toilet paper and i won't go get myself some fruit and whatnot for lunch so this works out perfectly all right i got this instacart picked up freaking shopping center is wild right now people everywhere This tree is pretty cool. Oh man. Freaking 20 mile mountain bike ride. 3,000 feet elevation. Beautiful day. All right, so I picked up this Mama Romas from my girl Carolyn. And I got an Uber in the queue. I went for a mountain bike ride today. And it kicked my butt, but I think I ate enough food. Because that's, that's the determining factor with going on a mountain bike ride for me. Because of how much going up and down the hills so much. <clears throat> if I don't eat food, I won't be able to do anything for the rest of the day. But if I stuff my face with as much food as I can, then I can stay awake and deliver more food. So other people can stuff their face. Alright, I did this Uber. Took a couple minutes. Got myself some melon. Alright. Five minutes after dropping off the Uber. Got him on my room. Alright, I got this Uber. It's a lot of miles, but it's been really slow today.
All right, I got another Uber immediately. I actually had a DoorDash in the queue, but that restaurant that it was at, I've had to wait at before, so. Let's see, they're trying to add me with something. All right, so they just added on, I think it was 527. It says zero extra feet. I have to go to Chipotle, which it's literally already on the way and these joints are dropping off right by my house. So, great orders. All right, so I dropped those two Ubers off. I filmed it, but I'm pretty sure it was just a black screen because my camera flashes. The phone's too hot, whatever. Flash isn't working. Uh, that second one, it said it was zero extra miles. Turned out to be 0.8 extra miles. Uber out here lying. All right, I got another number on this. This is gonna be the last one. All right, you made it this far in the video. You're awesome. Uh, if you haven't already, click that subscribe button right there. And uh, there's a video suggested for you right there. And uh, if you're not interested in either one of those, uh, got a video for you tomorrow. Take it easy.